behind me here on Milwaukee's north side. You're about to meet a man who's pulling out all the stops to help his community in need. Every Thursday morning two pieces of meat. at 1030 sharp, you like some? 33 year old Charles Hughes hands out hope at 35th and right. This is so nice, man. You know, it's such a blessing to me, to the people out here. People out here like Robert Lampley. Uh, everybody needs help sometimes. So when I met huh? this young guy right yeah, here, he told me that I can come on Thursdays and get things that I need. So I appreciate that. Come on. And for Charles, his desire to help others goes beyond faith. You know, I used to be these guys. I used to be on the streets. You know, I used to, I've been homeless. I've been homeless for three, four years, you know, at a time and had to learn how to adapt to the streets, the life. A life once fueled by his extensive drug use. I started doing drugs when I was 13 years old, hitting a crack pipe, you know, and um, just like everybody else, it just goes up or it goes down, you know, and I just, I wanted that feeling more and more and more all the time. So I just kept on doing drugs and kept on doing harder drugs. And nothing was, nothing was filling that, 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 that hole, you know. A hole that serving others through his job at Just One More Ministry helps to fill. There you go. Charles is originally from Arkansas. He moved to Milwaukee four years ago to get help for his addiction. Have a good, have a good day, brother. And he's never So two pieces back. of meat if you want any meat. A year ago, Charles moved to God Touch Milwaukee, a men's sober home that provides him with structure and instills accountability. You want some dressing? It's just, it's more than a strong faith base. It's, it's a brotherhood. It's also what helped him get his license and this job. You no, know, so that's that's what I the, I truly love about God Touch is is number one the street ministries. You know I love uh, that we are about community. You know about restoration. And while Charles's journey has taken a lot of twists and turns, it's not an easy road, but it's so worth it. You know, so worth it. He credits faith, compassion, and places like God Touch Milwaukee, keeping him on the path to recovery. Yeah. Want some chips? In Milwaukee. Good for the grandkids. Marty Glazer, Spectrum News. Oh, you have a nice day, man. Have a good day, brother. God See bless. You next Thursday, man. God bless. Yes, sir. You too.